For the first time ever, NASA says it has drilled a sample of rock on another planet. In August 2012, the space probe sent the Mars rover Curiosity to the red planet in hopes of finding signs of life. The rover successfully completed the first drill test in early February. Officials announced Wednesday Curiosity completed its first real sample collection, grabbing about a tablespoon of rock powder. And the initial analysis? Dust from that rock is gray and not red like the rest of the planet. Scientists say the gray rock could preserve any organic material better than the red surface. One scientist explains the orange color normally seen on rocks might be signs of a rusting process that oxidizes iron in the rock. The gray color may mean the rock the rover drilled did not go through this process. That may be good news for looking for evidence of past life because chemistry involving oxidation destroys organic compounds. The chief engineer of Curiosity Sample System says this is a major milestone in the Mars exploration, not only because this is the first instance any robot has drilled to collect a sample anywhere but on Earth, but it also allows us to go beyond the surface layer of the rock, unlocking a kind of time capsule of evidence about the state of Mars going back three or four billion years. A writer for CNET explains the high-impact drill used to collect the sample is the last of the 10 major systems on the rover to be tested since it landed in Gale Crater. And this success story has some NASA workers sighing with relief. Space.com reported last year Curiosity engineers faced issues with some of the rover's hardware and weren't able to completely fix it before launch, but did manage to provide a potential safety net. We're going to have a, a failure of our drill, a percussive element, because there is a there's a bond in there that we think under under cycle conditions will break. Since then, systems engineers have opted to operating the rover more cautiously to reduce the amount of wear and tear on the hardware. As for the latest discovery, NASA is still waiting on chemical analysis of the sample to understand the geological history and potential habitability of Mars. Stay tuned for more. For Newsy, I'm Logan Tittle.